So we are live now. Uh, Welcome okay. with me, everyone. My name is Aderonke Onikwede, and I have with me my amazing guest, the young Nigerians, the future of this nation. Nigeria will be 60 years old October 1st. And it is amazing to know that after 60 years, we still have a whole lot to put together, but we'll get there, and we are getting there. Welcome to Adironke Live Show. I have with me my lovely, beautiful young princes and princesses. You can see from their faces, these are great Nigerians. These are the future of tomorrow. These are the leaders for the Nigeria that we all claim we want to see. I have with me David. David Enobong. David wants to be a footballer. David represents the south south of Nigeria and he loves playing football. His role model is Ronaldo. Please welcome with me, David Enobong. Welcome, David. You are still going to introduce yourself properly. I have again with me my darling princess Naomi Zachary Buba. Naomi represents the federal capital territory in Abuja. Thank you for joining me, Naomi. Naomi is so shy, so calm. I thought that the meaning of Naomi. Naomi is a powerful name. You guys have big names. You can imagine David with that big name, with a sword and a shield. David, can you fight? Naomi. You know, Naomi is a very strong woman. Very powerful woman in the Bible. I'm sure you know that. And I trust Naomi that Naomi is an amazing man. Naomi wants to be a medical doctor. And I have my beautiful, my lovely... My humorous, very funny. She's a very funny girl. Kachi Tine, Tuku Yelong. Welcome, Kachi. Kachi wants to be a medical doctor, too. And she also wants to be... Uh, where's Kachi? Oh, dear. She also wants to be... She wants to, she wants to be the future president of America. There's nothing impossible. Nothing impossible. I love the dreams. And I have with me my Steven friend, my new friend, all the way from Joss. Steven! Drums roll! Yes, I have with me Steven. Steven is from just, just State and he represents the North Central of Nigeria. Steven wants to be aeronautic engineer. Oh my God! Amazing! What a and I have my beautiful, my darling, Kayla. Kayla Lassisi. He's from Oshu State and Kayla wants to be boom, 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 boom. Programmer! Amazing, Sheila. Well done. And I have my darling, Abiyadu Oluye Akiloluwa, all the way from Ekiti State, representing the southwest of Nigeria. Abiyadu Akiloluwa wants to be, whoa, he said he wants to be an excellent engineer. Hooray! Well done, Akiloluwa. May the Lord make your dreams come to pass. All of you, well done, Tams. I am grateful you guys are with me in the studio. And I'm so honored. I'm so privileged to have you guys. David, Naomi, Akinolua, Patricia, Steven, and Kayla. How are you guys doing? Fine, ma. Fine, ma. Are you sure? Okay. Are you guys fine? So what did they say? Yes, I said when we get to the studio, yes, we are going to yes, sing a song. What song are we singing? National Anthem. National Anthem. And I need you guys to give me your smiley faces. I don't want you to go, no. Don't be angry with Nigeria right now. Be happy. Oh yeah, let's smile and let's sing yeah, the National Anthem. Are we ready? Are we yeah. ready? One. Yes, two, Yes. Three. Go. Continue, David. I can't hear you again. I can't hear you guys. Nigeria 
Oh, yeah, you guys put your hands together for Nigeria at six. God bless Nigeria. So let me have you guys. Let me start with Kachi. Kachi, darling, how are you, Kachi? Fine, thank you. You're welcome, sweetie. Thank you so much for honoring me and granting my request. So, Kachi, tell me, how do you know you are a Nigerian? How do you get to know that you're a Nigerian? I know that I'm a Nigerian because my parents are Nigerian. Fantastic. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. I like that. Kachi says he knows he's a Nigerian because her parents are Nigerian. Okay, great. Great. Fantastic. So let me ask you, David, do you know the governor of your state? Yes, ma. The governor okay, of my state is Mr. Emmanuel Gabriel Udom. Mr. Emmanuel. That's a quiet bomb state. Fantastic. Awesome. So tell me, Akiloluwa Olule, what do you know about Nigeria? What are the things you know about Nigeria? Eh, I can't. I can't hear you. What are the things you know about Nigeria? Are you hearing Nancy me? Ronke. Yes. Can you hear me? Oh, okay. I'll come back to Aki. So let me ask Naomi. Naomi, tell me what are the things you know about Nigeria? I know it is the largest black African country in the awesome. world and it is situated in the western part of Africa. Awesome, awesome. Thank you, Naomi. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, the largest country in the whole of West. Akilolua is back. So Akilolua, tell me. Um, tell me who is your favorite leader in Nigeria? Who is your favorite leader? I can't hear what Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. I said, who is your favorite leader, leader in Nigeria? You were cracking there for a bit. What did you say? I said, who is your favorite leader, leader in Nigeria? Hmm. My favorite leader would be Dr. Bonaya Onu, our Minister of Science and Technology. Technology. Oh, that's huge. Why do you like him? Why do you like him? Can you hear me, Akinolua? Yes. So why do you like the Minister for Science and Technology? Why do you like him? There's something wrong with your network over there. Maybe it's your phone. There's something wrong. Okay, let me go to... Okay, let me go to Kela. Kela, can you hear me? Kela is off. Oh, okay. Kela is off. Okay, let me go to Kachi. Kachi, you said you want to... You want to become American president. Why? Why don't you want to become a Nigerian president? Um, I can become a Nigerian president. So, but my main goal is becoming the American president. Oh, oh that that hurt us a little. Why? Why would you? Why would you choose America over there? Okay, okay. I like the fact that you said you can also become an Nigerian president. But what makes you think think that you would want to lead America? Why? What are the things you've seen that makes you want to to want to be American president? I want to be an American president so that we can give black people a right to speak. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So just because we want equal rights for every race in America. Wow, that's huge. Well done, Kachi. Well done. It's possible. So let me go to Steven. Steven is back. Steven, can you hear me? Steven, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay, yes. awesome. Steven, tell me what do you yes, know about what do you know about Nigeria? 
I know Nigeria is my country by birth. Okay. Nigeria okay. is a Nigeria. is a country in Africa. Okay. What other things do you know about Nigeria? It's just, it was colonized by the British. Wow, that's true. That's true. Well done, Ephraim. Well done, Steven. Thank you. Well done. Yeah. Okay, you're still talking, Steven. Are you still talking? Continue, continue. No, ma. Okay, thank okay. you, Jerry. Thank you. He okay, gave me um, It's okay. Don't worry. I have other questions that work you. Ella, David, ah. unmute yourself. David, unmute yourself. Daddy, I'll send it. I'll send it. Can you back on? Uh, Kayla, can you hear me? She's been going up and on. Can you hear me now, Kayla? Okay, great, darling. So, Kayla. Okay, ma. So what do you want to see in Nigeria, Kayla? What are the things you like to see in Nigeria? Mm. Change of poverty rate. Mm. Mm. Change of poverty rate. Mm. Do you want it lower, higher? Yeah, what? Lower. Lower. Fantastic. That's a good one. Fantastic. What other things you want to see to change in Nigeria? Um, um like how the increasing prices of food of food stem food and everything should be reduced. It should be reduced. Inflation is too high. You want food stuff. Kela, do you like food? Yes. You like food? <laughs> so you want your food, the prices to be reduced. Fantastic. Thank you, darling. Thank you. So now let me go to Naomi. Naomi. Who is your favorite leader in Nigeria? Yes. Good luck, Jonathan. Oh, you like good luck, Jonathan. That's awesome. Why do you like him? Naomi, can you hear me? Okay. Let me move to Akilolua. Akilolua is back. Akilolua, I asked you why you yes. like the minister for science. Why do you like him? Because he provides school for... Okay, so for Naomi is back. back. Naomi, you said because he does what? That cannot go to school. Okay, he provided food, like okay, those, books for those that can't yeah, go to school. Yes, like those are Marjorie's. Okay, don't worry, Naomi. We'll come back to you, Naomi. Let's go to Akilolua. Akilolua, why do you like the Minister for Science? I like the Minister of Science because he has a very innovative mind and he knows how to come up with things to solve our problems. Oh, innovative mind to so come up with things to solutions to solve our problems. What do you think is our problem? Tell me one of the problems of Nigeria. What was that? What do you think is the problem? What are the problems of Nigeria? I can't hear you. Oh, yeah. I can continue. I'm listening to you. You see, the Minister of Science is helping to solve the problems of Nigeria. What do you what are the problems? Do you know any of the problems of Nigeria, Akilolua? Okay. David, are you there? David, are you there? Yeah. David, I can't hear David. Mommy and Daddy, I need you to help them with the network. Let the let them be stable where they are. When they keep moving, the network becomes, you know, their cameras is shifting. They are not stable. Okay, let's go to Kayla. Okay, Kachi, let me come to Kachi. He's back. Naomi, can you hear me?
Yes. No, ma, I can't hear you. Kachi, can you hear me? Yes. My the voice is low. I can't. I am the shouting where low. I am. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually screaming. I'm using my microphone and I'm actually screaming. You can hear me. I That's why you're responding. What solution? What what do you want? What are the solutions you want for Nigeria right now? Nigeria is going to be 60 next week. Are you happy with the way things are right now in Nigeria? No. Daddy yeah. leave us. She will answer by herself. Daddy, don't worry. She can answer by herself. Naomi, are you happy with the way things are right now in Nigeria? Mm. No, no, because thank you, darling. The things okay. are too expensive. Things Ma, are too expensive. I say the things are too expensive. The, the things are too expensive, so those in the lower class cannot buy anything, and that mm. is leading to hunger and those dying. Oh my god, thank you, Naomi. Fantastic, no, thank you, funny. thank you. So, inflation. Is leading is affecting the no. low income families, is affecting them. That that's what do you think the government can do? It can help those in the lower class by reducing the price of everything. Thank you. Thank you, Naomi. God bless you. Naomi and Kayla just said the same thing. The food prices are too expensive, especially for the lower class. The government should help by trying to get this um, prices down, you know, let the inflation stop. David, I told you not to mute yourself. You have muted yourself. I can't hear you, David. You need to unmute yourself. Guys, you're not, on, you're not in your Zoom class. This is not a Zoom class. David, unmute yourself. Okay, Stephen is back. Stephen, why do you want to be an aeronautic engineer? Because I, I have interest in the in flying. In flying? Flying flying how? I want to be part of the people who make flying to space to study easier. Oh oh, oh wow. You you would love to be part of the team that will go to space to study. That's fantastic. Yes. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Okay, thank you, Steven. So, do you know that takes a lot of hard work? You want to be part of the those that will go into that's an astronaut. You don't know an astronaut, am I right? So, or, yeah, or you right. want to be part of the team, you want to help them with their machines, their space, and um, the estate the that they will, they will use, the gadgets, the equipment they will need. Oh, fantastic. Thank you, Ephraim. So, how do you think in Nigeria? What do you think can be the solution to all? The, what, tell me one solution you think the government can do to help the problems of Nigeria. Creation of more jobs. Creation of more jobs. Fantastic, Stephen. Well done. Stephen is advising the government to create more jobs for the people of Nigeria. What other thing do you think they can do for Nigeria? One more thing. I think money should be shared from for the whole Nigeria and not only to themselves. They should share the money. They should share the money to everybody in Nigeria. They should not keep it to themselves alone. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Stephen. I like that. Thank you. So they should share the money. Okay, oh, government, please share the money. Can you hear me? I'm saying that you share the money. So let me go to Kachi. Kachi, what are the problems? Okay, David is back. David, I've been... No. Okay, David, are you can you hear me, David? Mm. Is somebody else there? Yes. Well, 
No, you can see somebody is talking. What happened in Why is it not? It's not oh, us. Yeah. I can see people moving. It's not us. Yeah, but Hmm? Oh no, it's a light. Yes. Who went offline? Who is speaking? Somebody else. It's Tony. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -mm. No, this is Can you all hear me? Even the 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 I think she's the colossal Okay. So can you guys hear? Can you guys hear me? We are live, guys. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We are back. Live. Okay. Yeah, I'm only three people there. Yeah. So I was about to ask um, Kachi. Problem is here. Mommy, mommy. I hear your voice. It's not us now. Okay. He's doing now. I see this from her own. Her own network. Why are you seeing them, Baba? So, Kachi, can you hear me? Yes. Kachi, so I want to hear your own voice. Tell me, what do you think you can do? We can make the roads better so wherever people are going they can get there safely without any accidents and they can get there fast. Oh, God bless you, darling. Yes, Kachi is saying that the government should help make the roads better for people so that they can reduce the rate of accidents in Nigeria. Thank you, Kachi. Well done. Akiloluwa. Give us one solution the government can do in Nigeria as Nigeria becomes 60 years old next week. We can start by hiring, getting volunteers and hiring more people to take care of the trash we see on the streets every day. No, I didn't. Okay, that's we should we should do what we should do what I didn't get that. They can hire more people. The government should hire more people. Okay, is that what you mean? It should hire more people to clean the de okay, the, the, the roads are too dirty. Okay, Akilolua is saying the government should hire more people to clean the roads. So those are your solutions. Um Kayla and um, Naomi said they should reduce the price rate. Inflation is too high. They should find a way to reduce inflation so that the masses can afford food. That's fantastic. And she said they should repair the roads. So that it should be roadworthy and they will reduce accidents. 
Stephen said they should share the money equally for everybody. They should share the money. Only one person should not take the money to themselves. And he, he, he also said they should help people get more jobs. Awesome. Can I now ask you, Kayla, you said you want to be a programmer. What does it entail to become a programmer? Oh, David is back. We've been trying to beat David. Okay, sorry, Kayla. David, are you hearing me? David, can you hear me? Yes, ma. I don't know what's wrong with your network. It's been going off, seriously off. Okay, can you hear me now? So, David, what solution do you want the government to put in place for the masses? David, what do you want the government to do for the Nigerian people? What do you want the government to do? David, can you hear me? David. David, can you hear me? David, can you hear me? I'm joining the game. I can't hear anything. Okay, let's go to. Okay, let's go. David can hear me again. Okay, yes, ma let's go to. Um, can you hear me now, David? This one I was looking for. Nothing. David, can you hear me now? Okay, David can hear me. So, who is your? Okay, um, let's. Now, me as well as who our own role model is. Okay, Lulu, I saw those who are home role model. Kayla, who is your own role model? I don't have a role model. Oh, dear. You don't have a role model. Why? I who do we want to... Sorry? I just don't see anybody that... I... You don't see anybody. Me and Kayla are zero care. Me and Kayla are zero care. You don't want to be, don't want to be your role model. You see her? Huh? Okay, okay, I understand you. How about, how about, okay, somebody, okay, maybe let me use another word for you. How about somebody that you respect, you like the way they do things, an older person. Like someone that is older and you like the way they do things. Okay, I'll stay. Kayla, are you still there? Oh, Kayla is off. Okay, let me ask Kachi. Kachi, who is your role model? My mom. Your mom, awesome. I can see mommy. Mommy, mommy will be so elated, so happy. Why is she your role model? Why? Because she's the one that helps me with stuff when I'm in time of time of need. You're in time of need, Kay. Ah, what what needs? What? <laughs> share with me. What do you mean by your time of needs? Please share with me. What are the time of needs? Kachi, yes. can you hear me? Kachi, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, what as, as, explain to me what do you mean by your mom is always there for you in the time of need? What do you mean by time of need? Like when I don't understand something, my mom is always there to help me. Oh, okay, now I understand. So don't say your time of <laughs> it's rather like you know, time of need, bow. <laughs> but it's fine, darling. It's fine. Okay, so Kayla. Okay, no, I've asked Kayla. Kayla, Kayla, now, are you sure? Okay, can you tell me? Even if, let's not use the word role model. Is there someone that you like how they do, you respect them? Is there anyone, any adult like that that you feel you don't mind? Maybe let's even give the person 60%. Yes. Okay. Who, who is that? My dad. Your dad. Awesome. Oh, so your dad is girl. So that is. Congratulations and to mommy Kachi. Congratulations. You've got yourself your mentees. Awesome. So, David, are you back? Can you hear me, David? David, can you hear me? 
Yes, ma. Awesome. So they tell me who, what you want to change in Nigeria. What are the things that in Nigeria that you want to change? I want to change the bad roads. Bad roads. The also, I feel that Nigerians should start the judge should start doing what? Time for the less privileged. We should support the less privileged. Awesome. Thank you, David. So every Nigerian should be concerned about the less privileged. The government, the people of Nigeria, everyone should be concerned about the less privileged. Awesome. Thank you, David. So tell me, David, who is your role model? My role model is Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, Cristiano Ronaldo. Okay. So why is he your role model? Ronaldo is not no, bad. Ronaldo is my role why is role model. model. Ronaldo mm -hmm. is my role model because he has a kind heart and also he plays because he has a kind the role. heart. And he plays and he plays he's a fair player. Wow. <laughs> like, <laughs> Uh -uh. Okay, now I see why you want to be a footballer in future. That's awesome. Ronaldo has a kind heart. How do you know he has a kind heart? How do you know that? Anytime I watch any of his matches, I see it in him. I see it in him when he plays. Oh, that's so sweet. That's awesome. Ronaldo, wherever you are, you have a fan, a big fan here in Nigeria. Please, you need to reach out to David. David loves you. He said, he's the way you play on the match. You have a big heart and he wants to be like you in future. And I pray one day you get to meet Ronaldo in Jesus' name. Awesome. So Naomi wants to meet Amen. Good Luck Jonathan. Am I right? Naomi. Yes, ma. Awesome. Awesome. Do you want to meet in future? Um, Steven, who do you want to meet in future? Steven, are you there? Steven, are you there? Philip Emegwale. You want to meet Philip Emegwale? Yes, ma'am. What did he do to, yes, ma to, for you to wish you want to meet him? Why? Tell me why. Why do you want to meet him? Steven, are you there? Oh, Steven is off. Okay, let's go to Kachi. Kachi, who do you want to meet in the future? I can't ask. Kachi, who do you want to meet in the I future? Want... I want to Um, the President of the United States. <laughs> So who is uh, who is the, at that time or now or by that time you want to meet whoever the president is? Is that what you mean? Or you don't mind meeting him now? Whoever the president is. Okay, you don't mind meeting um Donald Trump right now. Yes. Awesome. Donald Trump, you have a you have a big fan in Nigeria. Kathy wants to meet you and we pray that our dreams come to pass in Jesus' name. Yes, Akinolua. Akinolua, who do you want to meet in future? Akinolua, can you hear me? Akinolua, can you hear me? Yes. I do you want to meet in the future. Akilolua, who do you want to meet in the future? Can't you hear me? Huh? Pardon? Who do you want to meet in the future? Okay, let's yes. go. Who is next? Who is I said, who do you want to um, meet? I would like to.
Okay, okay let's, I cannot let's... hear what you're saying. But you just said it now, now. You just said, I would like to meet. I'm asking you, who do you want to meet in the future? Okay, let's go to, let's go to Kayla. Kayla, who do you want to meet in the future? I don't really have anybody. You don't really have anybody, but you want to be a programmer. Why, what, what makes you build your interest in programming? Why do you want to be a programmer? Because, like, anytime I, 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 I just feel like opening up and see what what made the phone. Oh, fantastic. Mm -hmm. So, do you love coding? Do you love coding? Yes. So, what has been you true on coding? My dad. Your dad, fantastic. Now I see why that is your, your role yeah. model. Awesome, awesome. So we know who Kachi wants to meet in the future. Kachi wants to meet Donald Trump. David wants okay. to meet Ronaldo. Naomi wants to meet Good Luck Jonathan. We are waiting for Akin to tell us we want to meet Philip, Philip and Mark Guale. Am I right? Now, Akilolu, who hear me? Akilolu, can you hear me? Okay, now let's talk. Okay, let's come back to Nigeria now. Nigeria will be 16 next week, and that's why the, we are all here. That told me the problems and what you feel is the solution. So, what do you think, as children, what do you think should be your own contribution to the change that you want to see in Nigeria? Naomi, as a child, what do you think you you can contribute to, to Nigeria? To be educated because. I know that knowledge has the power to liberate me from anything. Awesome. Awesome, Naomi. Well done. I like that. To be educated because you know education can liberate you from anything. Awesome. Steven's mommy, can you let Steven be? You are distracting us, Steven's mommy. You are distracting us. Thank you, Naomi. Thank you, David. How do you want to contribute to the development of India as a child? How do you want to contribute? By, I want to contribute by praying to God because, because God can answer anyone's prayers. Yes, very true. Are you sure you don't want to be a pastor, David? What do you say, Ma? I'm sure you don't want to be a pastor. Are you sure you don't want to be a pastor and a footballer? You said that by praying to God, all our problems can be solved as a child. Are you sure? You, do you want to be a pastor, David? No, ma. No. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So, okay, Stephen, is Stephen there? Can Stephen hear me? Steven, can you hear me? Okay, let's go to Akiloluwa. Can you hear me? Kachi is off. Yes, I can hear okay, let's go to you. You can hear me. So as children, how do you want to contribute to development of the area? By helping pick the litter from the streets. By picking litters from the streets also. So as children, we should try and pick up whatever thing we use, any waste, you know, the, the paper of uh, biscuits, biscuits, um, the pizza box, whatever thing we use, to make sure that we, we, we make the street clean and be that as part of our contribution. Well done, Akilolua. Well said. Kachi? Um, okay, about Kachi is not bad. Okay, let's go to, let's go to Kayla. Kayla, are you there? Yeah. Yes. Kayla, are you there? Yes. Yeah. Are you using two phones? Oh. Okay, okay. No, Kayla, I, I know you. That was it for you. Okay, Kayla, so Kayla, tell me, what what can children contribute to the development of the data? How can you guys help? You are only two way. By let's say giving out our uh, old clothes to the needy. Mm. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, Thank you, Kayla. Awesome. 
Continue. And like maybe writing to the government about all these problems. <laughs> Kayla, Kayla, Kayla. Kayla wants to be an activist. Kayla said we should write to the government about the problems of Nigeria. So we are not writing enough. Elders, leaders, are you hearing? Kayla said we need to write to you guys. So in case you don't know, maybe you are not seeing what is going on. Kayla is advising that we need to write to you guys about the challenges of Nigeria. And by two, by also, so all the children, if you can write, please start writing to the president of Nigeria. You know, start writing to him and telling him that as a Nigerian child, you are not happy with the things going on in the country and you want a better Nigeria. Awesome. Thank you, Kela, for that. And Kela said that we we'll give our clothes to the less privileged children as well, the clothes we don't use anymore. Okay. Stephen is back. Stephen, as children, what do you want to contribute to the development of Nigeria? As a child, I can you... start up voluntarily service. To... Yes. Awesome. As a child, you guys. I can... We are saying the same thing. Yes. To start up voluntary service. Mm. Oh, yeah. Explain the voluntary service. Explain in what way can you do that? Like, for example, me and my friends can decide to sweep the environment around us. Well done, Stevens. Well done. That's what Akilolu had to advise. Do not litter the streets as children. And Akin, and Stephen is saying that himself and his friends come together to clean up the environment. That's a good initiative. Well done, Stephen. I see leaders in you guys already. You guys are getting there very soon. This is the future of Nigeria, and I'm so proud of you guys. I'm so proud of the way you're thinking, you know, and you want to make a change. Kachi, as children, what can we contribute to the development of Nigeria? Now I see that you like food. What are you eating, Kachi? <laughs> I caught you. I saw you. <laughs> so go ahead. Tell me. Tell me, Kachi. What can you do to change as children? What can yeah. you do to contribute? Go ahead, Kachi. Okay. Kachi, um, go ahead. I... <laughs> I can start by following by changing the mindset of people to do the right thing. I like that. Hi, hi, fantastic, Kachi. I can start by changing the mindset of people to do the right thing. That means you have to start with your friends, people of your influence, people you can easily talk to. Well done, Kachi. I like the fact that you started with I. That means the change begins with me. Well done, Kachi. Great job. So let's go to... Okay, Akilolu has told us his zone. So let's go to the last round of the question. So for, ne for what, 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 what in the last round of... Nigeria is 60 years old. Which of the presidents of Nigeria can you remember? Not this one. Nobody should mention the present president. Nobody should mention the last president. How old are you? Okay, you guys are both 10 years, so you should be able to remember at least two presidents. Tell me, can you remember any? Okay, governor, let me don't leave it to you guys. If you can remember mm -hmm. any governor or president, apart from, you know, uh, President yeah. Gwari. Okay, let's yeah. start from Naomi. Orderliness, wait, guys. guys. Let's start okay. from Naomi. Naomi. Governor or president, can you remember? Or a leader in Nigeria? Any leader? Okay, let me make it open. Any leader? Any leader in Nigeria that you can remember? Which leader in Nigeria can you remember? Naomi, which leader can you remember? Dr. Inamdi Azikiwe. Dr. Inamdi Azikiwe. Fantastic. Well done, Kachi. Uh, well done, Naomi. So, David, which leader of Nigeria can you remember? Let's go to let's go to um let's go to Kayla while David gets his answer. Kayla. Kayla, Kayla which leader of Nigeria can you remember? What a quarter. 
remember anyone. You can't remember anyone. Good job. I like the sincerity. Yeah, yeah, you have she one you yeah. should be a leader one day in Jesus' name. Yeah. So David, go ahead. President Olusegun Obasanjo. Olusegun Obasanjo, he was president. Yes, well done, David. It's fine if you cannot remember. This was not part of the questions I sent you guys, so it's fine if you can't remember. It's okay. It's fine. It's amazing to be a fruitful child. It is a plus. Thank you, David. Thank you. So let's go to Akinolua. Which of the leaders do you remember? Which of the past leaders of Nigeria can you remember? Um, I didn't know you say that. Actually, that time. Governor Akinumi Ambody. The former governor of Lagos State, fantastic. Akiwumi Ambody. Yes, he was the former governor of Lagos State before Governor Jide Sonwolu. Well done. Stephen, which of the leaders can you remember? Which of the past leaders of Nigeria can you remember? Stephen? Stephen, can you hear me? So let's go to Kati. Kati, which of the past leaders of Nigeria can you remember? Muritala Muhammad. Muritala Muhammad. <laughs> Muritala Muhammad. Okay, good, good. Well done, well done, Kati. Well done, guys. Well done, guys. There's no wrong. Like I told you guys at the beginning of the show, there's no wrong. You guys are pretty young and you have a long way to go. And I'm sure. Step by step, we will put all the puzzles together. I like the fact that you are daring. You all came to the show with no tears in your eyes. That's the most important thing for you guys to understand that there's a, there's a virtual world right now, and we need your contribution, no matter how young you are. We need you guys to be part of the growth of Nigeria as Nigeria becomes 60 on October 1st, 2020. Well done, guys. La, my, my final, what, what final words do you have for everybody, for the children, for the adults, for the leaders, for the government? Who starts? Who starts? Who give me the final word? Before we go to the final word, can you guys speak your language? As at least say a little word in your language. Can you guys try? I can only why you are smiling already. <laughs> Naomi, can you speak Aouta? Just greeting. Can you yes, greet sir. us in Aouta? Oh, fantastic. Okay, go ahead and greet us, Naomi. <clears throat> Nani. Nani. What's the meaning of that? It means good evening in house. Sir. It means good evening. Well done. Well done. Great job. So let's go to David. David, can you greet us in your language? Yes, sir. Messi Ray, fantastic. What's the meaning of Messi Ray? Good morning. Good morning. Awesome. Well done, David. <laughs> Kayla, can you greet us in your language? Uh, Ekaro. Language. Ekaro. Mm -hmm. What's the meaning of Ekaro? Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Well done. Steven, can you greet us in your language? Is Steven back? Okay, let's go to Kachi. Kachi, can you give, greet us in your language? Ututuama. Ututuama. Ah, correct, girl. Do you speak Igbo a lot? The way you said it. <laughs> Ututuama, well done. What's the meaning of that? Good morning. Good morning. Awesome. I'm proud of all of you, each and every one of you. I'm so proud. Akilolua, can you greet us in your language? Ekale. Ekale, say it. Ekale. Ekale. Ekale, fantastic. What's the meaning, Nakilolua? It means good evening. It means good evening. Now you guys are going to promise me that going forward, you are going to learn more to speak your languages. Do you understand? That makes us, Nigeria is blessed. We have over 371 ethnic groups in Nigeria. Isn't that fantastic? 371 from the report I, I read online. And I'm, not, I'm sorry, I can't verify, the, I can't call the name of the source, but from a Google search I made, we have 371 language um, 
ethnic groups in Nigeria. That's awesome. So we have a whole lot of languages we can learn from. But let's even start with the, the general one, you know, the Yoba, the Aosa, the Igbo, and the South South. Well done, guys. I'm so proud of each and every one of you. And I like the fact that you are telling the government to something. They're not happy with the inflation of the nation right now. Things are too expensive for the low, for the masses. Everyone is affected, you know. So let's round off. You guys tell me, tell me in your final word. We want to see in Nigeria. What do you want to see? What thing, what thing do you want to see in Nigeria? That maybe you, if, you, if, you have, if you have traveled before or you have seen it in movies, you have never seen it in Nigeria. Tell me that thing. Anybody wants to build the car? I don't want to call your names. So just share with me. What are the things that you've seen somewhere else that is not in Nigeria and you would like to see? It? Who can share that with me? David, Naomi, Akilolu, Akela. Aki. Mm. Go ahead, go ahead if you have quietness. if you have any quietness. What do you want to see? Kachi, you want quietness. Awesome. Even me, I want it. So much noise everywhere in Nigeria. Uh, less pollution. Um, uh, less pollution. Oh my god. I wish I had a pen and please somebody should be writing all this point so that we can write to the government, like Kayla said. I love that. Kachi, thank you. Quietness. Less pollution. Please, our leaders, we want less pollution. We want quietness. Also, who else is saying something? 24 7 lights. 24 7 lights. Please. Echo electric. We want 24 7 lights. Constant power supply. Also, children are speaking, they are tired of the noise. They're tired of the pollution. They want 24 steps. Right. Thank you, Akilolua. Thank you. Who else? Kayla, you have something to say? Less traffic. Less traffic. Oh, God. So that, you guys are going through the same thing adults are going through. So now, adults, adults, mommies, can you see? These children know what is going on. They don't want traffic anymore, especially all over the cities of Nigeria. We don't want traffic. No more traffic. Fantastic. Fantastic. Akilolua said 24 7 light. Kayla said no more traffic. Kachi said tiredness. Too much pollution. Naomi, what do you have to say? The government should listen to. Awesome. Oh, I got I, I think I get that. Thank you, Naomi. The government should listen to the people. Hmm. The, this this is my wonderful charm are advising Nigeria in the in the celebration of the 60th anniversary that we should please listen more. Listen more to the people of Nigeria. Listen more. Thank you, Naomi. Thank you. Steven, are you there as we run off? Are you there? Yes, Pa. Your final word for the government. What do you want to see in Nigeria? I want to see a corrupt free Nigeria. A corrupt free Nigeria. Hooray! That's a fantastic way to run up. Awesome. Oh my God. I am blessed to have met you guys. I am blessed. I am privileged. I am honored that you guys came on my show. And I'm sure in the next 10, 20 years, 20 years. I will see you guys leading, leading, and leading nations, leading Nigeria, leading all over the world. I can see you guys shining like the stars that you have, shining brighter and brighter. I am blessed. Right now, this evening, I am blessed to have young minds, you know, honor me in my studio. Stephen Randa, you know, very well. He said, we want a Nigeria that is about free. We want a Nigeria from Kachi that is less noise, no more pollution. Akilolua said, no more power shortage. We want consistent power supply. Kayla said, we want a Nigeria, you know, that we can, we can what, okay, was Naomi that said that the government should listen to the people. Kayla said, no more traffic, no more traffic. And Akela is even advising elders, the children, let's write to the government. In case they have refused to see what is going on, maybe when they read our letters, they will put the change they require. 
God bless you guys for coming on my show. I'm grateful to have you guys. Thank you, Naomi, all the way from Abuja. God bless you, Naomi, Zachary Puba. God bless you, darling. God bless you, Akimoluwa Oloye, Abiodu Oloye, all the way from Lagos, all the way from Ekiti. Thank you, Kayla Busari Lastisi, all the way from Oshu State, Flash, Lagos. Well done. Thank you, Kachi. Chiku Yelum, thank you, Kati. Well done, darling. Well done. All the way from Anana, Anambra slash Lagos. I'm a darling friend. Steven, the aeronautical engineer, all the way from Plateau State, precisely just. Thank you, Steven. David is not online. I can't see David anymore. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Okay, David is back. Okay, so I have to you guys. David. Okay, David, are you back? Yes, David is back. Okay, yeah. Okay, that's where well, David is off again. I'm trying to add David so that we can all round off together. David and no bong. Thank you, David. Marty, thank you to all of you. In the next, please remember my name. Can you all remember my name? So that when you get to the state, to the state house or to the federal government house in Washington or in Asurok, anywhere you find yourself all over the world. Please, my children's name too are Onik Pede. My name is Onik Pede. Please remember me. I interviewed you the year <laughs> September 2020 because I see greatness. I see greatness in you all at the mercy of God. Thank you guys for honoring me. I will let you out of the studio. Please say a big thank you to your mom and dad for me, for granting me the opportunity to bring you on the show. Have a fantastic evening. So let's round up by saying the national pledge. Can we all say the national pledge? I let's look at this. 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 let Thank you, Naomi. Thank you, Kayla. Good night. Thank you, Kachi. Thank you, Nolua. Thank you, Steven. Good night, everyone. Thank you, guys. Bye. You can leave the studio. Good night. You can remove yourself. Bye. Bye. Good night, Naomi. Thank you, darling. Thank you, Akin. Thank you. Thank you, Good everyone, night. for coming on the show. I had a wonderful time with this, my amazing girls and boys. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Can you hear the feedbacks? Did you hear the solutions? Did you hear all the amazing feedbacks they gave? These kids said they don't want pollution anymore. So much pollution. Too much noise in Nigeria. They don't want noises anymore. Too much traffic. You know, too much traffic. They don't want traffic. They don't want, you know, too much breaking of power supply. They want it to stop. They want 24-7, you know, electricity in Nigeria. They want the government to listen more. They want the inflation rate to come down. They want a country that they can be proud to say they want to become the president of Nigeria or the governor. And I pray that their hard desires will be met, but we all need to help them. I like what Kachi said. She said, I. I like what Steven said. He said, my friends and hi. I like what Akilolua said. He said, we'll all stop littering the streets as children. Class said, let's write in the government. Naomi said, let's start thinking. Um, Kachi said that she wants to change the perspective of people. And Naomi said she wants to start seeing the beautiful Nigeria again, all over again, all over again. And I pray that their desires will be granted and our desires will be granted because this is our future. This is the Nigeria that we all want. Nigeria at 60, are we ready to be the change that we all want to be? We are the change. Our children say they are ready to be a part of that change. Mommies, daddies, are you ready? Thank you, everyone. I have the replay on my YouTube channel. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe, like, and comment. So this edition, trust me, in 10 years to now, these amazing six children, trust me, they will be in national newspapers. They will be all over the world, making Nigeria proud in their chosen field of career. And I pray that the nations of Nigeria all over the world will acknowledge the gifts and the blessings that God has put in them. Thank you, mommy and daddy, all the mommies and daddies, 
that have honored my invitation. I appreciate you guys to the Buseri family, to the Chukulerun family, to the Stevens family, all of you, to my friend Wumi and her son David, to everyone. Thank you to Akinolua, to the lawyers family. I appreciate everyone. Thank you for honoring me. Thank you for bringing the children. Or even when I came online, my darling Ronke, all the way in US. Thank you, sweetie. I see you, all my friends, and see you. Thank you for coming online. I appreciate you guys. Next week, we are still representing Nigeria. Next week, Nigeria will be 60. Nigeria 60. Have a wonderful night. Stay connected and stay blessed. Bye, everyone. Happy Independence Day, Nigeria. We will be great again by God's grace by you and I and by his grace.